guys, it's Auditing America. We're about to call these guys out on breaking the social distancing rules. Gentlemen, how you doing today? Good, how are you? Doing good. I, I'm just watching you guys exercising your social distancing very, very good. No mask, no social distancing. We have to, we have to uh, set an example, right? Yeah. Let's let's keep up the good work. Have a good day. Take care. Ah, uh, come on, cut it out. You guys are you you okay. guys are all bundled up right here in this corner. You have no to. Way. Don't do it. Why are you being disrespectful? You're my rights yeah. already. You're gonna get a complaint quick like this in a hurry. That's why he told you not to. That's right, fuck stick. <laughs> so how you gentlemen doing today? You guys, are you guys willing to ignore any unconstitutional orders? given out by governors and the president? Are you guys willing to, to follow unconstitutional orders? It's just a quick question. There's at least half a million dollars in salaries right here. Way more probably. And as you can see, guys, they're um, failing to set an example for the social distancing rules. There's only one officer with, with, a, with a mask. God knows how many people these guys have encountered today and within the past couple of weeks. We want you guys to be safe. We want you guys to be safe. That's why we're here. We want... We want to make sure that you guys continue to do the good work that you do and not get sick and, you know, not stand around doing nothing. This guy's real comfortable right there leaning on. And of course, we're exercising our First Amendment, our constitutional given rights. How do you, are you guys, um, is it your policy to identify yourself uh, to a member of the public when asked? Do you guys have business cards? Yeah. You have a business card? You can take mine. Cool. Let's, let's, let's keep it, let's keep it distance. Well, yeah, just like you already gave the example. Thank okay, you. Look at that, that's six okay. feet. Thank you very much. You're very nice. James. Are you a police officer? Not. Public, oh, the public health guy arrived. <laughs> the public health guy arrived. Sir, we've been waiting for you. These gentlemen over here. <laughs> Are you a public, uh, did you come over here to tell them to spread out? I'll send you, uh, I'll send you pictures, have a good night. Okay, thanks guys. Oh, the public health people arrived, you see? You guys have to keep your social distancing. <laughs> this is awesome. Remember guys, you might think that he was extremely rude to you guys. But the First Amendment is about, it's not about the weather, it's about controversial speech. So, you know, we, you guys swore to protect that. You guys are supposed to have a thicker, a thicker skin when it comes to that. So thank you for not falsely accusing anyone of disorderly conduct, or thank you for not trying to solicit a trespass either. Come on, Sergeant. You have to keep it a little bit more professional. You're the leader. You're the leader. All right, see you later.
Walk of shame. <laughs> Walk of shame. Denver police fails to set an example for the citizens in Denver. He, he wasn't rude to me. Well, yeah, he said go away or something like that. But for the most part, yeah, you know, they they know that they were wrong. They know that we caught him off guard. But it's just, it's a learning lesson for all of us. These guys are now lining up. Right here, very nice for the camera. I want everybody to go to subscribe to... Colorado Lookout. Colorado Lookout and to Pike Speaks Auditors. Also find Auditing America on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. Also, go to Demand the Truth. Demand the Truth on YouTube. We need to get him over 9,000. This guy already has 7,000 subscribers. We need to get him over 9,000. Share, like, and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Denver, Colorado, beautiful, beautiful city, beautiful city. These guys over here are hardly working. <laughs> They're all lined up like little soldiers. So the sergeant left and then they just, they just left these fools here. Yeah, the sergeant was wasn't very professional. Was he the one that had help? He he was going like this. Oh yeah, like blah 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 blah. Right like the constitution is the constitution is blah 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 to some people, but not to us, the people. But no, it rolls downhill because I remember over there off like six or seven blocks over that way there was a shooting and the, these cops were just horrible, man. District one, district five, Denver police are corrupt. Sad news. That's why Auditing America do what they do. We're holding people accountable for their actions. Police officers got hired to do the right thing, not the wrong thing. If you wanted to do the wrong thing, you have to become a criminal, not a police officer. Yep. So, you guys were out here with Auditing America.